Hey guys, welcome back to Forest Speed Shop. So today we are working on this Briggs & Stratton 531cc engine. So I'm gonna see if it spins over and if it fires up and if it does, I might try to use it on something. So yeah, let's get to it. All right guys, so to get this to work, I gotta uh, tie this rope onto this little pulley right here. As you can see, it's got like a notched V-belt kind of thing. So uh, the electric starter, I hooked up a battery charger to this. The electric starter doesn't work. So I'm going to wrap this up and we'll see if it spins on over. charger down here battery charger but I just pulled it over faster than I was pulling it over before and it made a couple popping noises so we're gonna pull it over a couple more times faster this is honestly the worst I really wish this uh A little bit more starting food. Okay. Ready? Damn. Howdy. <laughs> That's awesome. That thing sounds so cool. All right, we're going to do that again. 
That took a second to fire up, but it fired, and that's insane to me that it even fired away like that. And it spins over so nice. Hold on, one more time. Maybe I can be handy with the, uh, the starting fluid. Oh, I'd, I'd need to change the oil before I do that. <laughs> Hold on. Let's see, one more time. rest of this apart just to make sure to get all the rat's nests and stuff out of this because this is a welder or it's mounted to a welder and uh, I don't want any fires starting because that'd be no bueno so <laughs> I'll get to doing that here in a second <laughs> check the oil first. That's usually a good idea. Uh, <laughs> I was going to say, I'll get it running like it was before and then try to spray some uh, starting fluid into it, into it, see if it'll keep revving up. Oh, I can't get that open. Oh. Alright, I'll be right back. I need a pair of pliers. Alright, plier time. There's still rust in it, but it's got a filter. No way. Dude, there's only like a pile of rust in the bottom. I'm not gonna put gas back in there, but I just have to look. It's a possibility of putting gas back in there, but not a, not a good one, you know. Uh, let's see. I can get this fired up again. Yeah. Set the camera right here. Okay. All right. So move stuff around so I can get over here. We're going to fire this thing up. So my camera's about to die, but that gas tank I just said I wasn't going to use, I'm going to use. So it's got a filter in the bottom. 
but we're going to uh, tie this up. And if this thing fires up with gas in it, that will be insane. All right, ready? No, okay. Yeah, I don't think it's getting any gas. But uh, next time, I'm going to uh, fire this thing up, probably pull the carb off, make sure it's clean, and then uh, we're gonna try to weld with it. And uh, we'll see how that goes. So y'all have a great day. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification button to see more. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Have a great day and thank you for watching.